Oh gosh, camera's too high. The camera is far too high. Welcome back everybody. This is Enigma and we are going to do some more Borderlands 3 today. I hope it's something that you want to see as uh, I haven't played it in a couple of days. So it seems to be that people like it when I play games that I'm good at. So hopefully this will be one of those things that really gets, gets, uh, gets us some views today. Hope you're having a great day today. Uh, it is a very blustery winter day here in the suburbs of Chicago, near our volcano lair where I live. And uh, it's, uh, you know, what can you do? It's it's Chicago, so uh, let me go ahead and tell everyone that I'm here. Okay, got that going. Alright, so uh, guys, if it's your first time joining me, welcome. Hope you're having a great day. Uh, please look at my social media links below. I do have uh, Instagram now. I have a YouTube. I have Facebook. I have Twitter. Uh, I am all over the place with, uh, with some of this stuff. here and over here gotta edit my panels a little bit now I still need to edit them so happy you're having a great day today uh, hope nothing bad's happening to you every day is a great day as far as I'm concerned I hope uh, hope you feel the same way oh, come on yep you know, ah, oh, get back down, get back down, get back down. I have to hand it to Twitch, and, and I really mean this. Ah, oh, golly. They make some things very easy, and then they make some things difficult <laughs> to do. All right, now that that looks better. All right, so yes, I have all sorts of stuff there. Uh, as you see, I have Instagram, I have YouTube, Facebook, Twitter. Uh, you can subscribe to support me. You can also donate to my PayPal if you'd like to. Uh, if you can't, please don't worry about it. I understand completely. Uh, it's not been a great financial year for a lot of people, uh, this guy included. So uh, I don't give people crap for uh, not being able to uh, financially support a streamer. So <laughs> don't worry about it. If you can, that's great. If you can't, no big deal. So... Um, View, I just really appreciate the views. That's what, what really matters to me in the long run. So here's what we're going to do today. Uh, we're going to play some Borderlands 3 content. I'm going to use my uh, wonderful little uh, Amara here. She is a big sis Amara. She's really good. And as I can see, we have a weekly, which should be very simple for me because I use nothing but Maliwan weapons. 250 enemies with Maliwan weapons. Kill the brood mother. 20 spider ants and thunk and sloth. Okay, the spider ants are going to be on Pandora. Thunk and sloth are on Pandora. Brood mother, huh? I got to think where brood mother is. <clears throat> Pyre of the stars. Okay, so that's over on Necrotefeo. So let's go ahead and take that on first. Get the map. Now, if it's your first time joining me at all, uh, I'm actually pretty decent at Borderlands 3. It's probably the game I'm most proud of with my arrogant at all. I'm very modest about myself. <clears throat> but I would say I'm pretty good at Borderlands 3. Uh, Necrotefeo. And the Pyre of the Stars. So this is the last area, the last real map that you go through in Borderlands 3. Um, we're going to have to go through the whole map to get to the Broodmother, if I'm not mistaken. Because I believe she is right about there. Yeah. That's a swarm host. Is that right? Hmm. 
Yeah, that's where it says it is. Okay. So uh, this, this of course, is the last map of the game. We're going to fight mostly Guardians. There's going to be some COV in there as well. Now, Maya Mara, if it's your first first time joining me, Maya Mara is a uh, mobbing queen. She's a uh, Ties That Bind, Ricochet, uh, Phase Grasp. Uh, yes, yeah, just a monster at, at, at mobbing, as you're going to find out here. She's not going to win any bossing uh, awards, but she's dang sure going to... She's very good at taking out mobs. For bossing, we want to get uh, my Moe's. My Moe's is far better at bossing. I am an Amara main, and Moe's is my secondary character. The other two, I'm not a big fan of either uh, Flak or Zane. Uh, I'm sure there are people who are, and that is perfectly fine. That's the one, one of the things I like about this game a, a lot is, is that you can have people who all use the same character. I could have three different, di three other Amaras with me right now, and they would be dramatically different. They could be dramatically different from mine each with different uh, oh, uh, emphasis on things. Mara is a very diverse character. Uh, there are people who use the melee builds, and melee Mara's are better with bossing. They're better with pure uh, damage to one single target. While Smya Mara is more about, let's see how much damage we can cause over a wide area. And that's uh, pretty much what I do. Let's move this camera down a little bit more. There. <clears throat> there. So, uh, that's that's how we do things here. Uh, with, with Mar now, I do. I have been using uh, Cryo as her attuned element. Amara is a elemental juggernaut. So, you are uh, using Amara, unless you are using a straight melee build, her uh, elemental damage is going to be her bread and butter. She does a lot of elemental damage. And I know a lot of folks are saying, why aren't you using Shock as her attuned element? I really, I could be. But, uh... I've been loving Cryo a lot lately, so... Looks like we're about to get a Guardian token as well. There we go. Now we're gonna get into some COV spawns up here. I've killed more than 25 with Maliwan weapons, but the way this game is, uh, when it says we want you to kill with Maliwan weapons, they mean base weapon damage. They don't mean I can't elemental damage or ties to bind damage or remnant orb damage. What they mean is it's got to be straight Maliwan gun damage in order for you to get credit for it. It can be a pain to do it that way, to do that, but it's all right. So the morning stream was very good with Borderlands 2. I did really well on that stream. I hope everybody that was here enjoyed it. I will pick it up tomorrow morning, right where we left off. We'll do the, uh, there's another mission that Claptrap had for us there. And, uh, of course, we need to do the uh, actual story mission as well. See, it's all about distribution of damage with Amara in this build, is that she will take down things all over the place. 
I will not pretend like I made up this build, because I did not. Found it online. I believe it was a Moxie build. But I did make some small tweaks to it. Oh, we have Guardian Token. Let's see. Vehicle Grenade. Movement Speed. Accuracy or Recoil Reduction. This vehicle I know. We'll do Grenade. I don't really throw many grenades, but... You know. And we're gonna fill up our ammo here. Amara can run out of ammo. She doesn't have near the stability ammo-wise that Moe's has. And again, a lot of characters are like that. See that? She just exploded three dudes with one stream of bullets. Or five dudes, I mean. I, I, it's, I just love it. Mars' big weakness is while while elemental damage is her bread and butter, uh, gun damage is not going to win her any. She's not going to win any gun damage awards. That's for certain. I know pew pew. A lot of people like to know pew pew. Hey, get away from me! It's a top five. The no pew pew is a top five assault rifle. Might be better. It might be number two. It's either two or three, I would say. Behind, uh. It's definitely behind the Monarch. But it, whether it's as good as the OPQ system is debatable. You'll see if he didn't stand a chance. <clears throat> I'm not using shock as the attuned element because my, uh, uh, first of all, I'm using the plasma coil, and the plasma coil has that pretty sweet shock effect. Second reason is because whenever I pop my shield, whenever I pop my uh, action skill, I automatically get double my damage and shock. So Amara is perfectly uh, attuned for dealing with guardians without even having her uh, to attune her element to shock, which is her base element to shock. I prefer, I, I like the middling element of cryo, because cryo is going to be good for, it's the second best element against armor. It makes armor brittle and it shatters which there can be uh, armored guardians. I, hope you're up. I also like the fact that it stops things in its place. Mara is so good with, with element elemental damage. And combine that with Maliwan weapons, and that's all they do is uh, no. elemental damage. Good stuff. Our buddy Fish Slap, Mr. No Days Off, welcoming me back to Borderlands 3. You'll see that she's got the ricochet going there. She got like a 30% chance of ricochet when things aren't grasped, and I think it's 75 or 60 or 75% when they are. Mars is all about distribution of damage, so you can really mess up a lot of guys. That's an anointed. He's going to be a little bit more of a pain. The anointed are always, they have bigger health bars. And since Amara is not going to do win any awards with gun damage or single target damage with this build. Come on. Really? Is that what we're doing today? Takes a little bit more. Doom is gone.
Okay, so I believe the brood mother is over here. Because believe it or not, we've actually marched all the way through Pyre of the Stars. It seems like it's short, and it's a pretty good place for experience, to be honest with you. Not great compared to Handsome Jackpot and a couple of the other places, but it is good. Okay, why isn't there a brood mother here? Did I look at the wrong thing? Save and quit. She's supposed to be there and she's not. So it's apparently she's one of the few rare spawns left in the game. Let's see. They used to. They used to make it to where the rare spawns were not rare anymore. They were always there. You enjoying the show? Yeah, I took you down. There it is. Taken down. Okay. So we killed the brood mother. Of course she didn't drop anything worth a darn. Now we're going to go and we're going to take care of the spider ants next. Because uh, it's going to be a little bit more of a pain. We're going to go to... They're, they're on Pandora. Spider ants are on Pandora. And the place I know where they definitely are is Devil's Razor. I'm sure there's other places they spawn as well, but I'm. I know there are spots around Devil's Razor where they are. See those? Those are spider ant hills. So I knew. I know these things. I drink and I know things. Let's go ahead and refill. <clears throat> and. Head on down there and just kill some spider ants. We can get a vehicle if we need it, but we really don't. They're just spider ants, no big deal. Spider ants are much easier in this game than they were in the last one. Most of the reason is because they are not elemental at all. And in Borderlands 2, they can show up as fire. Anything fire is pain in the rear end. And uh, corrosive. Which they say poisonous, but what they mean is corrosive. People... Uh, use that word way too much. Come on, I want a damn challenge. You can do better. We've already killed that. 75 enemies. The the antelope there is actually also a spider ant, so he should count. Here comes some spider ants. Any time now, guys. Uh, okay, there we are. That's it. Don't make a fool out of me. I know there's spider ants here. See what I mean about her, her damage being so insane. She basically just pours through mobs like they're not even there. There's something behind me. Yeah. Doing alright? How you doing, man? Yeah. 
clue behind that. Ah! Did that get us to 20? I don't think so. Oh, it did. Okay. So, uh, the last is Captain Sloth. Uh, it's Captain Thunk and Sloth, and they're going to be over in Conrad's Hold. That's the place that, uh, they're the dedicated drop for the It's Piss Grenade mod. A lot of people like that grenade mod. That and Fish Slap seems to be the, the two favorites for a lot of people. I think I use the Hunter Seeker or something. I, like, never throw grenades, so. Oh, it's a Merv Hex. Yeah, the Hex. Pounded that. Waves against the rocks. Sure, if you want. Here comes the drop. Always wanted to kill a siren. Somebody shoot this one. Him. I hate guys with shields. Were you even trying? Ready to unleash this power. In that building is where we're going to find Sloth and Thunk. Single target damage is not a Mars thing, but we'll eventually we chop down that tree. Whiskey, you laying on a sunbeam, buddy? They're gonna spawn right up there. They're gonna jump down from there. So that's if I let them jump down from there. A lot of the time, I kill them before they come down. Like that. Yeah, they're dead. Already forgot about you. Quasar rerouter. No pew pew. Got a couple of no pew pews today. And we have been. We see these. For some reason, with Amara, if these anointeds, if you, if she's only attacking the anointed, then uh, she has very low weapon damage. But if she's, if there's many of them, she just plows right through them. The more there are, the more she likes it. Ah, come on. He dropped the grenade mod? Nope. Mongol. He drops the Mongol as well, I believe. That's a newer uh two hickey uh, rocket launcher. Borderlands and rocket launchers are kind of funny because they release them and then they realize they're too powerful and they always have to nerf them. That just if I was just attacking Roaster, it would have been a longer, longer battle. But the face puncher. But uh, with Amara, the more enemies she has in that that phase grasp that ties the bind, the more damage she distributes among all of them. So 
don't know why, how, why it works that way, but it does. Josie bite. Happy now. She dropped. She dropped. Electric slide and the deathless. that, boys and girls, is how Amara clears out a mob. Nemesis is what she dropped there. Damage all over the place. up here that we can pop. A grape we can pop. Yep, there is. Come on, whiskey. Come on, whiskey. Come, come on. Oh, he doesn't want to. Death shot, did you want me to power level your guy? Or are you still here? There's a vault card level. You can see here we now have 115 out of 250. So we're we're just motoring right along with the Maliwan weapon kills. Which makes sense, because as I said, it's all uses melee one weapons, so. It would be really difficult if it were Jacobs or something. Then I'd have to get a, a, a Hellwalker and then just get close quarters with everything. Barkids. I guess he left. He's waiting for me to invite him? I don't know. I have to invite him in a group. See, that's what he wanted. I can feel the power. And Manvark. Manvark has several phases he goes through. Don't waste your ammo. He's gonna, yeah, and you can't pop his that pod either. You just have to wait for him to come out of it. does have to go through all those phases, so nothing you can do about it. I am Halfway home on the Malawan weapon kills for the dailies, or the weekly, I mean. So not bad. Oh. Let's 
So since we're leveling him, it's going to be... Uh, we don't. One thing we don't want to do is... Uh, I don't want to take him into a circle of slaughter or anything like that because he'll... He'll have... Uh, he'll have to be involved in the fight, so... That wouldn't be worth it for him because he would end up getting... getting killed a lot. And that's not why he's here, to get killed a lot. This is all too easy. I'm just getting warmed up. Greetings, Vault Hunter. I am Sir Hammerlock, and I require you to hunt and kill things for me. Yeah. See the borderlands are full. Why are we going? Nobody does. You want to do the slaughter, the circle of the slaughter shaft? Okay. Where is he? Now I ain't about to hate the player, and I sure don't hate the game. It is what it is, and my brothers and sisters ain't afraid to fight you, even knowing the odds. Get in there, player. Sure. Torque here, and I'm just going to say this one time. You gotta come in here. It won't let me start it without you. Get ready for some more pandemonium. That's a big word. How are you doing that much damage if you're only level 15? I think uh, Wednesday, if you're not aware, that's going to be the day that uh, Halo comes out. I don't think I can have the camera up and running on Xbox, because this is a PlayStation camera I'm using. But uh, I do plan, I would like to stream the uh, campaign mode for you guys. second part. Okay, round two coming up. Where are you? You coming?
So I do plan on doing Halo when it comes out. And I hope that everyone is looking forward to that. Seems to be the, mo the game that gets the most attention for me is Borderlands, so... No problem with that at all, I do love Borderlands. But I do know that every once in a while I play something a little different. Why you make so many DM? Okay, guys, I do have now, along with my Twitter and Facebook, uh, I also now have an Instagram and a YouTube channel. If you want to see some of my gameplay from Borderlands 2 and 3, uh, that's, it's, you can watch it here on Twitch, of course, but as soon as I get done with Twitch, I uh, take it and uh, put it right on YouTube. And if I can grow that, maybe I will start taping some actual real con uh, original content for YouTube, like how I feel about what's going on in gaming news and things like that. I am a 15 year industry of the, of the uh, game industry, and uh, I have opinions. <laughs> Tuned element being what it is. It really, uh, really makes it worth it. The damage distribution and freezing them in place. I don't know what he's using. Thank you. 
You can loot all this stuff, dude, and sell it. You can have all the money. I'm not looting money. Are you talking about looting money in this game? That's... I'm not doing anything. I'm not looting anything, really. Oh, feel free to uh, give me a sub if you <laughs> if you can. <laughs> All right, we go. He's freezing. They get stuck. Nothing they can do about it. So we have a guardian token. We'll have to look at that. Can we get a minute? Wow, I didn't... There we go. Yeah, I didn't even see that guy popping me, but he was shooting through the grates or something, I guess. Super ball and a tungsta. Let's see what we got with our guardian token. Oh, shield capacity all day long. Just bumps it up ever so slightly. Trade what? I don't really have anything to trade. It I'm going to give you money. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. There we are. You want me to give you money? Oh. Well, it's not like I have, I have no need for it, so. All right, let's go ahead and continue. This stuff's worth a whole bunch of money too, man. You should be taking it and selling it instead of worrying about trading. Grab there. 
175 out of 250. say that for everybody I play with, but for me, this is, everything is legit in the game. And you could make a character just like mine if you wanted to. He's doing a lot of damage. I need ammo. So I'm gonna go get ammo. Oh. Well, I should go get him up. Oh, dang it. Now sit there and think about what you fucking did. Okay. I didn't see that you died, man. How did you die? Last round, the boss will appear here. It's Titan.
Attention! Two hundred of two fifty ma uh, Maliwan kills, so that's cool. Only fifty more, and we'll finish off the weekly. goes. Titan. And drop the shred of fire. in the mission. Chests. What do we got here? One key. That's cool. We have all that done. We have unlocked all the vault card stuff. I wonder if they're going to do more vault cards. play through some of the story. Okay, we can do that. You'll have to leave and invite me to your game.
And once we get our weekly out of the way, we won't have to worry about that until Thursday. If it, the weeklies reroll every Thursday, the dailies reroll every day. Usually it's about um, 10 a.m. Central Standard Time uh, where I live. About 10 a.m. they reroll the dailies, and then on Thursdays it's the weeklies. And they give you little bonuses to your vault card. That's why I do them, just for fun. I've already unlocked everything on the vault card, so... Uh, where... Okay, my character is pending. Okay. Hit that Starving. wrong. Okay. Something's weird here. Hey, you made it. My ship's <sighs> gotta go. Please, buddy. Given that unconditional surrender, any more thought? Or do you need another love slap from your old pal Laseroid to change your mind? Something is weird here. Screw you! When you're ready, just swing by with the paperwork. Can't wait to absorb Atlas into the Malawan family. Oh, and you can bring Zero. I'll bet he's interested. I'd die before I hand over Atlas to that corporate asshat. New plan. New plan. We steal a Malawan shuttle with security protocols. Here, take this. Okay, that's how it works. Figured it out, I think. So, uh, the Viper Drive is Atlas state-of-the-art remote hacking. Now we'll use that baby to steal a Malawan shuttle. You in? Already doing it in my mind. And the mustache boy. Just got a story. Focus! Uh, just, just find yourself a Malawan shuttle and pop in a Viper Drive. I will do the rest. Okay, time to try out the Viper Drive. Yes, we're in. Ah, <laughs> Reese comes through. <laughs> High fives? Hey, anybody? Uh, okay, okay. Hey, uh, let me know when you're there. Charge! Come on, more! All right. Yeah. Yeah, guys, give me a follow. I'd appreciate that. We're up to 64 followers now. 
And I'd like to see what we can do. Get me some. Oh, I have two followers on. Uh, well, that actually worked. Oh. I mean, of course that worked. <laughs> and uh, and no death spheres in sight. Uh, what's a death sphere? Uh, never mind. Uh, that is the Sonora, Kanagawa's pleasure yacht. Rumor is he invited his siblings on board for a party. And murdered them. them. That's how he became head of mergers and acquisitions of Malawan. Oh, by the way, be careful with this low gravity. Might take some getting used to. Thing of beauty. I'm not really interested in any of the guns or anything here. I don't know what level these things are anyway. They're 38, so for me it's nothing. What I've been waiting for! Shooter spent Are we through here? Uh oh, looks like there's security up ahead. You take care of them. I will make sure they can't call for backup. Looks like I have two followers on uh, my Instagram now, and I have a subscriber on YouTube, so that's cool. Nice murdering! I'll find you a way in. Um, pop a Viper drive into that console so I can hack security and locate the fragment. So find some cover and ambush them. Ah, uh, here they come. Enter the base and pop a Viper drive into the security console. Then I will hack in and locate the laser control room. The main elevator leads right down to the laser. <laughs> we'll be in and out so fast, Kanagawa won't know what hit him. Now call the elevator. It'll take you right down to the laser. Passing security protocols now. I said now, now, now. You stupid. <laughs> oh no, Reese, is that you? Welcome. So once we make your unconditional surrender, nice and official, you and I are gonna partay on the Zanara. <laughs> That's my pleasure yacht. Security, kill the Vault Hunter. Is that the best you've got? It's my favorite laser, Reese. Oh, uh, hey! Yeah, uh, see the, uh, huh, the whole laser thing. Well, um, just, just making it hard for my employees to work down here. Really starting to get morale. Who cares about them? I'm doing this for us, the people who matter, the executives. But you're ruining it, Reese. You're ruining it by trying to defend yourself. They lead straight into the maintenance area. Hold them off! Uh, I can fix this! Oh, Reese. 
I know your stupid vault hunters are skulking about. Better sign those surrender papers, buddy. Otherwise... Hmm. Laser fire in three, two, one. Oh, that was my favorite bagel place! Katagawa, you monster! Booyah! And that's only half power. If you don't surrender soon, Reese, I'm gonna slice you in half. Hold him off. Then he allied with the stupid children of the vault. Those cultists have been working themselves to death. I, I can't compete with free labor. It's true. In so we're helping him out here in the story. My There's. I'm just kind of. He doesn't really need my help. It looks like I'm just. Old. I think uh, I'm really doing him a lot of good here. Now we can take this time to talk about other things, I suppose. weekly done. That was easy peasy. Style. 
Oh, that is perfect. It just screams Reese. Reese! Use the Viper Drive. Viper Drive. When you just gotta know what your neighbors are saying about you. <sighs> Sounds good too, right? Not, um, changed in any way? Your voice is like a nervous angel. Mm. Oh, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> I think I'm getting the hang of this. <sighs> so for the record, this is not a probe. Do not call me Reese Probe or whatever. Call me Reese Sphere. Well, that's, that, that, that's actually, that's pretty tough to say. Reese Feet, Reese Sphere. Oh, ah, ah, I just bit my tongue. Call me Reese Ball. Time to stop that laser and get your whole key fragment for Atlas. All scan complete. That does not sound right. This way to the control room. Hmm. Ah, crap. This is a pleasure sphere, not a death sphere. I've got lubricants. Attention, loyal Malawan personnel. Anyone who brings me a dead vault hunter will receive a two-hour pass to the Zanara. <laughs> Currently in orbit and featuring a 25 cheese nacho fountain, round the clock skag oil massages, and privacy boots with our service bots. No questions asked. I'm really pixelated in this game on my my stream here. are still scuttling about. You just won't give up, will you, Reese? Well, that's it. Say goodbye to your favorite Frogert stand. Not friends. Frogert. Anything but friends. Frogert. I mean, I mean, they, they, they give you that. that. This is really pixelated for some reason on my stream I'm looking at.
Security, they're in the laser control room. Destroy them immediately. Really? Please listen. For real talk, someone stronger was going to take over Atlas. If it wasn't Malawan, it would have been Jacobs or Vladoff or even Tedior for crying out loud. Yeah. True, I killed a lot of your employees. Like, a lot, a lot. But that is just how business is done. Okay, there's something wrong here, so...